So you're thinking about moving to Inglewood or Clayton, Ohio, and you have a $200,000 budget. Well, you're in the right place today. I've got a great video in store for you. We're gonna look at three homes, one in the low 200s, one in the mid 200s, and of course, one in the high 200s. We are starting our tour today here in the Inglewood Metro Park. It is a 1900 acre facility with horse trails, hiking, biking, there's a reservoir here so you can fish. It is a fantastic place and it is the perfect morning to go out and look at some real estate. It's the second day of fall here in Ohio and it is a crisp, clean, 57 degree morning. So what better day to have you join me Nice. and go look at some real estate here in the Inglewood Clayton area. I will tell you, Inglewood Clayton, just so you know, uh, Dayton is, probably about, so Inglewood Clayton is northwest of the city of Dayton by about 10 minutes. So it's about a 10 to 15 minute drive, just depending on how far you are out uh, in Inglewood and Clayton to get to downtown Dayton. And then also uh, roughly about a 15 to 20 minute drive over to Wright Patterson Air Force Base. So just to give you some context. But anyway, I don't wanna hold us up any further. I've got three great homes for us to look at today. So let's jump right in. Hey guys, if this is your first time to the channel and you want to know everything there is about living in Inglewood or Clayton or any of the other surrounding suburbs, make sure to hit that subscribe button, tap the little bell for notifications so you can be the first to learn about the market here in Inglewood or Clayton. My name is Mike Wall. My team and I get calls and emails from people just like you every single day looking to make the move into Inglewood Clayton. We absolutely love it. So whether you're looking to make a move in the next nine days or 90, doesn't matter. Give us a call, shoot us a text, send us an email, or even schedule a Zoom call in the link below. We have to help you make the smooth move to Inglewood or Clayton. Okay. Thanks for hanging in there. So now we are at stop number one for today. We are in the North Creek subdivision here again in Inglewood. This particular house is a two-story home. It is um, vinyl constructed, built in 1994. It's priced at $210,000. And here you can see the home behind me right here. Oh my God! Wow! It has four bedrooms, two and a half baths, built on a slab, 1,764 square feet, which puts it right around $119 a square foot. The lot size is a corner lot. It's 0.34, so it's a, it's a medium-sized lot for this price point. Uh, it has a two-car garage, remodeled kitchen, and remodeled primary bathroom. So they've done some updates here. The neighborhood is... I don't know, it's just a really good feeling here. It, there, there is uh, a lot of houses built around that, you know, that uh, 1990 to 2000 range, but most of the properties are very well kept uh, and the streets are clean. There are sidewalks everywhere. There is an HOA here, but it's only $50 annually, so it's not much money at all. And I would um, think that that's probably just to take care of some of the common areas here, but they do a really good job with this neighborhood. The cool thing about this house too, is um, it does have a corner lot so you are getting a bigger lot here and you're around a lot of other similar homes that are all well kept the thing i guess the only drawback uh, on this particular home as you'll see behind me here is it does have a fence but it has seen better days probably was put in in 94 when this house was built but hey you're going to run into that from time to time Again, though, just to recap this one, it's a $210,000 two-story here in the North Creek subdivision, a beautiful home, beautiful neighborhood. So if you have a $210,000 budget and you're looking to live in the Inglewood Clayton area, this one might be a good one for you. Let's go take a look at the next one. All 
right, all right, here we are. Stop number two for today. We are in the Concord Meadows subdivision here in Inglewood, and the house we're looking at now is a ranch-style home with vinyl siding and stone trim. And it was built in 2017. It's three bedrooms, two full baths, as you can see here behind me, built on a slab, so no basement here. 1,534 square feet which puts it right at $159 a square foot. The lot is 0.19, so it is a smaller lot, but you're gonna see more of that in that two to $300,000 range, especially with a newer construction home. As you can see, it has a two car front entry garage. The ranch style home here features vaulted ceilings, new luxury vinyl flooring. Uh, it has a copper farmhouse sink, which is really cool. I'll include some photos here. And, um, the neighborhood, as you can see behind me, is uh, still being constructed. So if you don't like this house, perhaps we can find you a lot here and put something together that is more to your liking. But most of the houses that were built in and around this neighborhood are fairly similar. In other words, they've been built here in the last 10 years. And so, you know, a lot of these um, production built houses uh, are going to look fairly similar. In other words, they probably have five or six different models that they sell and uh, you know they just change some of the aesthetics or, or the colors on the outside of the home. But I'm gonna walk down here and just kind of give you a feel for what some of the other homes look like here behind me. And you can see up and down this street. Uh, I will say it is a very nice neighborhood. It's super quiet here and it looks like most of the properties are really well maintained. So if you have a $245,000 budget and you are looking to live in the Inglewood Clayton area, perhaps, that's a good fit for you. Let's go take a look at the next one. Stop number three, and if you stuck around this long, you must be really starting to like me. <laughs> so I promise not to disappoint. This next home is a two-story home. It's brick and vinyl construction. It's priced at $270,000. It's here in the Sterling Woods subdivision in Clayton. So we are just south of Inglewood now. This house was built in 1995. It's four bedrooms, three full baths, and one half bath. 3,032 square feet, which puts it at $89 a square foot, which if you've seen any of my videos, you know that $89 a square foot is a real value, especially here in this area. The lot size is 0.31, so it's a medium sized lot. It has a two car side entry garage. Um, this house has two kitchens, so one kitchen on the main level, one kitchen in the basement. And I will tell you, this neighborhood, um, for the most part, is very well maintained. Most of the homes are uh, two-story and ranch style homes, production built homes built between 1990 and 2005. And as I said before, it seems like a really nice quiet area. I like quiet. The um, houses are very well kept. As I said, for the most part, there's not a lot of traffic back here. So it seems like a very safe place for kids to ride bicycles or skateboards. And um, I don't know, the neighborhood just has a good feel to it. Yes, you're right. There are sidewalks here and um, you can see a lot of, I don't know that it's an HOA community, but I don't see a lot of um, things that would uh, necessarily deter people from living in this area, other than there are some chain link fences and some people don't like that. But anyway, if you have a $270,000 budget and you are moving to the Inglewood Clayton area, this home might be the perfect home for you. They say a picture's worth a thousand words and video must be worth a million. I love doing these videos. I do these videos for one reason and one reason only. That's to help educate those of you trying to learn more about the Inglewood or Clayton areas in Ohio here. My name is Mike Wall. My team and I get calls and emails from people just like you every single day looking to make the move to Dayton and we absolutely love it. So whether you're looking to make a move in the next nine days or 90, it doesn't matter. Give us a call, shoot us a text, send us an email or even schedule a Zoom call in the link below. We'd be happy to help you make the smooth move to Dayton. Thank you so much for watching.